after Newton, for a long time, everyone thought that light was some kind of mysterious particle, something called a corpuscle. And this was the kind of the predominant theory surrounding light for, for decades. But Thomas Young, a really incredible physicist and physician, was one of the first people to show that light's nature is a little bit more elusive than just a simple particle. Um, he was one of the first to show that light actually has a wave nature um, in what is now an extremely famous experiment referred to as the Young Double Slit Experiment. Okay, so what Young essentially did, um, he had an apparatus looking something like this. So he directed light, um, we prefer to use monochromatic light, but in Young's case he used sunlight. He directed a beam of light onto a double slit. Okay, and if light was a particle, he would expect to see only two kind of bands of light on the screen behind the slit. Um, and those two bands would just be the light that passed through the slits. But instead of seeing just two bands for each of the two slits, he saw this whole sequence of alternating bright and dark bands, which seemingly came out of nowhere. So how can this be explained? Um, Young was initially puzzled by this observation, um, but the way he uh, justified his observation was by interpreting light as a wave. He said that light was a wave, and when it passed through the two slits, the light waves diffracted. And when the diffracted light waves um, interacted with one another, they underwent constructive and destructive interference. At the places where, let me just get my laser pointer, at the places where um, the light underwent constructive interference, by the time that um, constructively interfering light reached the screen, it formed a bright band. Where the light underwent destructive interference, it formed a dark band on the screen. Okay, so because of the constructive and destructive interference of light, he said, we kind of create these alternating bright and dark bands on the screen, or a diffraction pattern. And this experiment, um, now really famous, provides us a glimpse into the wave nature of light. I don't need recognition. I'm on a mission. Yeah. I'm paying dues. Yeah. I'm in position.